Alrighty, hello everyone, welcome back to another video. And here we go, we have the special operations update. A very, very unique update here. And as you can see, we've got special operations game pass for FD. Uh, so this was released just now. We've got loads of different things. We've got mobile command center for police and a new civilian vehicle. So let's go and check out the update here. Going over to Roblox, first of all, uh, if we go and open Roblox here. Um, as you can see, if we scroll down into the store, we have this new FD special operations game pass, which we'll go and buy. And in the game pass, it includes so special operations truck hazmat suits hazmat tools water rescue tools and tech rescue tools got the update log here as you can see we've got a ton of different things we've got life rings uh safety ropes this is really really cool honestly um i'm excited for the safety rope actually that looks like it could be really interesting we've got deployable tents wash stations and we've got a ton of different things as well command unit here you're op you're able to open the rear door as well so it's actually got an interior this, I'm very, very excited. So we're hopping in the game currently to go and check this out here. Uh, once the OC decides to load, because there's probably about 20,000 people trying to load in at the same time here. So we've also got a new major server call, which is an oil spill. Um, and then, yeah, basically they'll be able to... Oh, so if we go over here, go to the bottom. Oh, look at this. So we've got uh, new calls, oil spill and chemical spill. So looking over here, we've got a new civilian vehicle, 2022 Falcon Traveler. So, it's probably going to be under SUV. There we go. Look at this luxury vehicle. Oh, oh wow. It just looks like they've extended it really far. So, let's go and spawn this in real quick and we'll go and check this out. Then we'll go and check everything out on the other teams. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay, I'm honestly not the biggest fan of this car. But uh, it does look like it has pretty good uh, traction and acceleration for a vehicle this uh, size and this big, honestly. So, yeah. That's pretty cool, to be fair. Um, anyway, so we're going to go ahead and head on to police real quick. We're going to check out the command unit and then we'll head on to FD and check out the what we get from the special operations game pass. So over here, dear me. Oh, that thing is big. This is cool. Hello there. Hello, Tigers. All right, let's do this. See, so this is for the max rank and you get it for free, as you can see there. It's got an interior as well, which is amazing. And you can put liveries on this. You need to put the back down, I think. Uh, it says you can put the back down. So somehow we need to do that. There's a side entrance here, it looks like. Um, there we go. So we've got side entrance and then if we put the back down, oh, this is actually really cool. So we've got like an inventory room here and then, oh gosh, um, as you can see, we can actually sit down here in a passenger seat. We've got a couple computers. It'd be nice if it kind of like anchors it to the ground because everyone running inside, it gets a bit chaos. But yeah, somehow you can open this back door. I'm not sure how. I think Tigers can do that as a vehicle owner, but I'm very, very excited to be able to use that in role plays. It's actually actually looks like it could be really cool oh look at this so there's a switch on the side as you can see there's a small switch on the side and we can open the back ramp here um and this is really cool hello there sorry um and apparently oh yeah we can actually get custom uniforms so if you go into the menu now in vehicles you can get custom uniforms that you've uploaded that is a really nice addition so overall i'm very happy with this uh, vehicle on police and you can uh i believe customize the livery i believe so if not uh, i may be wrong but I think so. That is really cool. I'm very, very happy to see that added to the game. If we head over to FD here, over to FD, we've got the new special operations hazmat. Uh, and then, oh, we've got the rope. Okay, this is cool. This is cool. So, first of all, uh, with the new game pass, which is 400 robots, you get the new uh, vehicle, which, there you go, special operations game pass, uh, just under 50k. So, we can go and spawn this in here. Oh, it's like a beefy vehicle. Look at this. Um, so we can go and spawn this in. And then if we go over here to the equipment lockers, we've got a couple new tools we can actually use. Quite a few new tools for this game pass, actually. So we've got, oh, safety rope, hazmat neutralizer, life vest, life ring, deployable tent. Wow, we've got a lot here. And wash station. So let's go and put these down and check these out. So first of all, the wash station. Basically, people decontaminate people. As you can see, you can walk through, role play decontaminating. I really do like that. Can you, oh, you can actually place down multiple. I really like that. I'm a big fan of this here. We've got a deployable tent. We could actually kind of do camping role plays with this almost. That is really cool. So you can actually go inside. It's pretty basic. There's nothing inside really, but you can actually see from outside to the inside. And um, it's kind of like a tent that you can have things in and the doors work and everything. So you can go inside. I really do like this here. Uniform's broken. Oh, sad. We've got a life ring. We'll go and check that in a second. A hazmat neutralizer. So this is what you pour down uh, on the hazmat cool. Okay, I think I know actually how to use this now. So what we want to do is we want to head up here. Let's say we're climbing up this mountain here. Uh, basically, you... Oh, okay, there we go. There we go. So we attach it here. And then 
Oh, okay. So I think I know how this works now. You you can attach this to other people. So, for example, I attach it to Ollie, and there you go. It kind of brings him with me. There you go. All right. Do you want to? Oh, oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Okay. Yeah. So basically. Oh, okay, so it attaches to the train. So, for example, I can attach it to there, and then I can go down the mountain, and then if I fall, it will catch me. Ah, that's cool. And then I've got my life vest on. If we go to car as well, we've, we'll go and test out the buoyancy aid in the water. So, we'll just kind of drive over to the uh, pond area. That's probably the best place to check it out real quick there. Uh, new vehicle's quite nice as well. Got a ladder on the side here. And uh, while we do this, we'll actually go and spawn in the new call in a second. All right, so we've got the safety rope here and we've got the life ring so we can throw this in ah okay so um oh okay no oh so you uh, ah you accept to be attached to the safety ring that's cool so let's see if i go into the water can i use this life ring here am i able to use this life ring oh yeah get on and then you're in the life ring ah that's cool and then they can pull you in oh, i really like that feature there you can kind of kidnap people with that that is a really nice feature i like that i like that all right we'll save you we'll save you we'll throw in the life ring there you go. Pick up anyone. All right. Go on, Cap. Go on, Cap. We'll throw it at you again. There you go. It's right in front of you. There you go. Can we can we pull you in now? Can we pull you in? No, you didn't get on mine. All right. And in the chemical spill, there's an oil spill and a chemical spill. Uh, but uh, oh, sorry. There's an oil spill and a chemical spill. But uh, we're gonna go and check out the chemical spill because I think they'll be pretty much the same or similar-ish. Anyways. All right. We're a bit slow, but we are responding nonetheless to this chemical spill. And from the thumbnail, from the kind of the teaser image we got yesterday, it looks like it's going to be some sort of DOT truck that kind of flipped carrying it. Uh, let's have a look. We can see over here. Uh, okay, all right, so I see I see something. All right, so there's some... Oh, yeah, it looks like there's some... What is this? Oh, jeez. So, yeah, there's some chemicals on the ground. We can use our uh, chemical... What is this here? Our hazmat neutralizer to actually pick this up there. I actually forgot to show this off in the video, so we're just recording this after, but we've got the new hazmat type. So we've got the different hazmat gears. So we've got this one, which is the uh, level C suit here. Um, then you can go and equip this, so we're going to take this off. And then we'll go and put on the level uh, B. So this is the level B. And you see orange, kind of more protection. We've got an oxygen tank on the back here. And then we'll take this off and we'll move to the level A, which is the full the full gear here, the full mask going all over our face. And this does look really cool, I have to say. Amazing, amazing update. Um, anyways, that is really cool. So thank you very much for watching this video. Hope you did enjoy. Lots and lots of really cool features. And I honestly think the Game Pass is really worth it. 400 robots and you get a ton of different gear and equipment. So I honestly think it's worth it. But anyways, thanks so much for watching. Stay tuned to the channel. Make sure to subscribe for daily role plays with this new update. Have a great day and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.